How's it going, people? Um, I'm Jay Higgins here. I live in Arklow. Um, I'm just here tonight to talk about the uh, corruption that's going on in our country um, with the guards and with um, the likes of um, HSE, government, um, parish, judges, the whole system, like, really. Um, I'm a big activist. Um, I help out a lot of the different groups um, as an activist. Um, I'm just here really to talk about um, the Yellow Vest Earl. Um, there's a guy that started off a GoFundMe, and this guy wants to go for me to be where it donates money for his fuel leaflets banners etc but when i was an activist i personally never asked anyone for money for fuel or for you know stuff like that what i did was if i couldn't afford to go i just wouldn't go uh, the group we had in artlow uh, artlow says no to water charges we used to put our own money together to make our own um, leaflets and um, some weeks some people couldn't put money into the fund on, and some weeks people could so um, I'm just here to talk about um, the guy that's uh, the so called leader of the Yellow Vest um, he's not a nice man um, he's backed by certain people um, that think he's invincible but he's nothing, you know. The Yellow Vest Ireland has failed people. Um, we, me and myself, actually brought the people down to the port tunnel back in about a week before Christmas, would have been a week and a half before Christmas. And um, this lad takes all the praise. Um, kind of jumps onto bandwagons he's doing stuff that we did five years ago um, me and three other people I'm not going to say their names organised a lot of marches from Liberty Hall up to the Keys blocked the port one blocked the East Link Bridge um, and this guy here would that's the leader um, took all the praise um, opened up 32 pages Believe it or not, the yellow vest, one for each county in Ireland. Um, he lost a lot of followers because um, five different women actually were harassed by this certain in person. Um, he's a very nasty person. Um, I'm just asking people to watch and don't donate to the other West Ireland because why should you pay for his fuel or banners and leaflets leaflets are a thing in the past leaflets were like five years ago the water movement when this guy actually never even existed in the water movement um, I've done my research on this guy and this guy wasn't even in the picture so um it's up to you as folks, but if he's wanted to donate twenty quid or whatever, bigger field juice. Um me personally myself, I wouldn't give him the steam on my piss. Excuse me French. Uh, he thinks that the um, yellow vest is gonna be like the yellow vest in um France. But I think there's max twelve in this group. Um don't get me wrong now. There's a lot of the people in the group I have a lot of time for. The group would have grown if me and other members would have been let take the group over because we've got connections to, for other groups that, that would have joined but a lot of groups won't join because of this certain person that's meant to be the leader um, I don't like saying names for personal reasons but uh, he knows who I'm on about he lies um, he states that his daughter's window got broke he states that his car's and tires got slashed uh, he's full of shit 
So I'm just hoping this video gets back to him because he has been blocked on um, Messenger and Facebook. Um, he's got another little lad running around with him that's in the yellow vest movement. Um, this little lad came from Donegal, came down to Dublin with literally not even a shirt on his back. Um, fell into a group called Take Back to City and now joined up with the Yellow Vest. Um, he lives in a, a squat in Pier Street. I'm not going to say his name, but that kind of just that's enough. A lot of people, anyone that knows who me knows who I'm on about. Um, he's another nasty person. Uh, he'd stab me in the back. Um, he says that I'm. He actually stated last week on social media that I actually get paid by the state, which is a lot of lies. That's why I spent like 2015, 2016, and 2017 sitting in court up to twice a week for our different jumps up charges. So, um, Mr. Little Dunny Doll Boy, you, um, you want to get your facts right? Or, um, let's put it this way, um, you, you know. You, you will suffer the consequences in the long run if you keep on slandering me on Facebook, uh, calling me a rat and stuff. Um, I'm not looking for trouble, but um, if you want it, no better man to give it to you. So, uh, peace out, folks.